Something I've seen a lot of people talking about is what's going to happen with cases. Obviously, everything is extremely expensive and doesn't seem sustainable, so is Valve going to step in and do something about it, especially when CS2 actually releases? Or are we going to see an entirely new drop system? Today, let's talk about it. But just before we hop into it, if you're sitting on a bunch of CSGO skins and want to get rid of them for a fair price, check out the sponsor Skins Monkey. Not only does Skins Monkey offer fair value trades for your skins, but you could also use that code at the top of the description for a free $5 bonus. If you're getting bored of your play skins, you could also easily trade them out for good investing items that have significantly increased in value over time, so be sure to check them out. But for now, let's get right into the video. Well, something people really don't realize is that even though cases are getting a lot more expensive, there's all-time high amounts of people unboxing them because of how expensive skins are getting alongside them. And as I'm sure a lot of you guys know by now, Valve gets a pretty big cut of everything sold on the Steam market, obviously cases included. So cases getting more expensive is doing them a favor as well. And I don't think they have any reason to change anything until maybe those cases unboxing numbers go down or something, but I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. People seem to be happy just degen buying into them for now. But another argument I've seen is that Valve maybe will increase the case drops of two per week instead of one per player. And I think the same rebuttal can be made like this guy said in a Reddit comment. Decrease in cost of cases does not mean more openings. Openings are at an all-time high because when cases are expensive, skins are expensive too. People that open cases don't care about spending an extra one dollar they're gamblers all they see is a potential 2k skin or obviously an expensive knife there is that chance you get something insane so with that being said let's change the subject back to csgo operations or i guess cs2 operations because i like a lot of other people think cs2 should absolutely be released with a new operation it'd be a great start to bring players tons of money it's literally the perfect time to release one and ideally it's going to be a huge money maker for players as well as i've mentioned with the cases before if valve continues to release operation cases like they have with the whole battle pass system and that seems to be the main thing across every game right now fortnite overwatch uh valorant i don't really play any other games besides cs and overwatch so i'm just trying to think of anything off the top of my head but i'm sure there's others and i think there's something similar going to be released again and judging how low the supply of operation cases has been in the past and how quickly it gets eaten up on the market i think the next operation case if we do even get the next operation is going to be one of the best investments if things continue the way they have been and i mean they should especially if we get cs to released. Look at how Riptide and Broken Fan cases have done recently and just overall the whole time they've existed. Honestly, I'd compare a new operation case to something like the Clutch case when it got removed from the game. Although the Clutch case isn't obviously an operation case, it had tons of supply on the market and a lot of people were thinking that it's too high risk, there's other cases with gloves in the game, stuff like that. Like when an operation case gets removed from the game, there's the Snakebite case for example that's still an active drop and people were thinking the operation case won't be a good investment same goes with the clutch case and the release of the revolution case but the thing is the clutch case is one of the most unboxed cases in the game and operation cases tend to be really similar to that too they tend to be the most unboxed cases in the game especially when the operation is actually going on and as time goes on as there's less supply on the market not only does price increase in those cases but all the supply once again gets eaten up which is why i think a next operation case is going to be a really good investment. Judging by how things are in the past, judging by how many cases are in box now, it seems just like free money. But we'll have to see if Valve actually does it the same way. But with the M4A1S Gamma Doppler in the game files as well, I think that's a fair reason to assume we're going to get some sort of similar operation style like we have with Riptide and Glock Gamma Doppler trade-ups, but we'll see. We really don't know. But yeah, as always, if you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and of course, check out Skins Monkey for that free five dollar bonus as well but for now i'll see you guys next one peace